Belize's next generation was taken to explore the Silk Key over the weekend to show them the importance of preserving the island. In recent days, Placencia residents and stakeholders from the tourism sector have embarked on a reclamation project to stop the erosion issue that has overtaken the island. Placencia tour guide Walter Garbutt led the project and he stated that it is important for the community, especially the younger generation, to see what the island has to offer. We're showcasing what Silky is to the community and in, in the wider to the world. The importance of in, it. Huh? The importance of it. We'll even have like snorkeling trip whereby we, and we have the top-notch guides that will take these people directly on the tours. So instead of you tell somebody, sometimes we have this comparison that tourists might come and seems like they love the country more than us because they see what we have to offer. So today is to let the whole generation get to see what is here. We have some lady up to 60 years who are living in Placentia and whole life and never been here. The reclamation project stirred up controversy and Coast Guard officers immediately halted the work being carried out by the residents due to not possessing the proper authorization. The Minister of Blue Economy, Andre Perez, explained that he commends the group's efforts, but his ministry must ensure that further damage to the marine reserve does not occur. Area Representative Rodwell Ferguson visited the island and he says that authorities must partner with the residents so restoration can be carried out the proper way. It's a good initiative, mm -hmm. but I guess it's a public property mm -hmm. and so the authorities are saying then that they are mostly a dialogue between us as experts and you. But once that is established, then there should be no issue at all. Several tour guides have visited Silk Key since the commencement of the project, and they explained that the island is important to them as it is the only island in the area that isn't privately owned. For years we've been using Silk Key, one of the premier islands. As a matter of fact, it's the only, only island. If you look around all the islands, it's private. It's the only island left for Belizeans. So the effort being put forward here, I don't think any Belizean who is a real Belizean, born Belizean, should be against it. They should be for it, and even more, they should be here working. Um, first of all, Silky, who, who've known it for years, like myself, was a much bigger island. We used to sleep up on top here, we had grass bed. Okay? For years, we're just watching it erode, erode, erode. We've tried a little effort a little over a year ago, some reclamation, nothing, nothing, no, no, no help came. So we had the pause, that didn't work, it continued, go, 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 so this was the best effort. As a matter of fact, um, now that they're bringing pressure and, and Silky, attention must be brought to Hunting Key and Saltwater Marine Reserve. This um, island gives us um, our daily bread. You know, we, this is our livelihood, this is what we do. And this is one of the reasons we're trying to preserve this island. Reporting for Love News, Giovanna Mogel.